Spectrum, you have a major problem with the Wood Avenue office in New York City. Oil. And let me explain why. Why you have a major fucking problem there. Let me give you some background on your Wick Avenue office. I paid my cable bill through the office. I go there in person and I pay it. Well, I stopped going there three months ago because every time I go there, paying the bill becomes secondary. They try to sell you your garbage ass uh, cell phone service, which we all know is complete trash. That's the first thing they want to do is sell you that. They don't even care about taking your money for your bill. So after countless times of me saying, I just want to pay the fucking bill, and even the last time, finally telling them, say, this, I don't even pay for my cable. I don't even pay for my cell phone. I go, I type in a code in the fucking uh, access settings, and I get free service. And they were like, oh, could you show us? Could you show us? So I, I typed in some different code just to show them, and they were I go, you got to search online, this and that, whatever. I, and they were searching for it. So I said, you know what? I'm, I'm tired of going there. I'm going to go to the Niles office next time because this one here is just too much of a hassle. So I went to the Niles office the last three months, and it's been great. You go in, you pay. They don't even mention the cell phone service. Nothing. They don't mention nothing. They take your money like they should. So today I didn't feel like driving to Niles. My cable bill's overdue. So I go to um, the Wick Avenue office. And as soon as I walk in there, it's empty. No one's there except for three people that are working there behind the windows. And all three of them are like, oh, I'll take your service. And the one girl's like this girl in the corner. like, oh, I'll take you. I got you. So I go down to her before because I've never seen her before. The one uh, black gentleman that I dealt with before was just trying to sell me a cell phone before so i says no i'll go this one because i've dealt with him before and he don't take no for an answer either so i go to this girl and she's looking at my cable bill and i said i want to pay 300 dollars of this and she's looking at it looking at it and she goes i see you have a high speed internet um uh, who's your cell phone service i go i'm good i got a phone i don't need it. i go i'm good i just want to pay the cell phone bill. i go i just want to pay my internet i just i just want to pay my cable bill i go i just want to pay the cable bill she goes well could you tell me your cell phone provider? i go i'm good i don't i got a phone i don't need another one i know people that have your services I, i'm good and she's like, well, could you tell us your cell phone server? I go, I just want to pay the bill. That's it. I don't want nothing else. I just want to pay this bill. And she's like, well, could you tell us? I go, I just want to pay the fucking bill. I go, you know what? Fuck it. I'll go to Niles. I'll go to Niles. I'll go to Niles. And I left. And I went in the parking lot. I was like, fuck. Because now I got to drive to Niles to pay a bill that I should be able to pay at the Wick Avenue office, but I can't because you have vultures in there trying to sell your cell phone service of yours that is shitty as hell that I don't want, that I told him I didn't want fucking 10 times. I know you have a, a camera in the store and I, I beg of you to go in there and, and listen to what happened. I beg of you so you can look at it and try to show your employees how not to deal with customers. When they tell you they don't want your cell phone service, that they don't need it, that they're just here to pay a bill, you tell them, take the money, take the money. All I wanted was to pay my bill. That's it. Take the money. The money is secondary to them because you either don't pay them enough money or give them some, some type of incentive, the more cell phone service you sell. And I, I'm, I'm honestly believing that you don't pay them enough money. So they're trying to make ends meet. And I understand that. That's why I tried being patient. But I said four fucking times, I just want my, I just want to pay my cable bill. That's it. I don't want cell phone. I have a cell phone. I don't need a cell phone. I just want to pay the cable. But could you tell me your cell phone service that I just knew? So I beg of you to go to the Wick Avenue office and listen to that conversation. And tell me I was in the wrong, please. Tell me I was in the wrong. I stopped going there for a reason. They just hound you about your shitty cell phone service. You know how shitty uh, Spectrum's cable is? Their cell phone service is 10 times worse. Trust me. And I don't even want your service. Your cable service sucks now. So I thought about it. Why should I drive 10 miles out of my way to pay a cable bill? Why? Because I tried paying it at your office and not a thing. And you know, I thought, I said, I don't even blame that girl. She's just trying to. And then I thought about it. No, I do blame her. You know why? Because she, if you listen to the fucking video, I said four fucking times, I just want to pay the cable bill. I don't need a cell phone. I don't care about it. Pushy. Pushy. And that, that's all your employees there. Not just her. I've dealt with them before. That's why I went to the Niles office. Now, I don't think they need fired, obviously. They're just doing their job. You obviously probably put pressure on the cell. But how come in the Niles office, they don't ever give me... I, I go in there, hey, this not... Don't even ask me about a cell phone. They don't even bring it up. Now, why is that? Are you paying them more than the workers in Youngstown? I don't know. Maybe you should pay the people in Youngstown more. Maybe that's why. Because it's, it's quite evident that you give them some type of incentive or you don't pay them enough because... 
This was absurd. This was fucking ridiculous. And I've been thinking about canceling your service anyway, because it's fucking god awful. But now, I'm done. I can't even pay a cable bill. Because that Wick Avenue office is just too fucking pushy with your cell phone, your shitty service at that. It's horrible. I don't want it. If I needed a cell phone service, I'd go, you know what? I want your cell phone service. But I don't. I don't. In fact, the last time I was at that office, I told him I, I, I type in a code in my access setting and I get free everything. So I had to act like I, I took, I said, yeah, you got to type this code. And I go, change this every week though. So, and plus, I go, you got to go online to do it all. And they were, they were searching for it. I just wanted them to, to stop asking me. That's all. So I had to make up a lie while I get free service uh, the last time. So I stopped going in three months. I started going here. But I was in a hurry today. I didn't feel like going to fucking Niles. So now I'm in Niles, and guess what? I went to Ollie's. I said, I'm not paying it. I'm done. I'm canceling your service. And I'm not, like I said, I'm like Tony Soprano. I'm not trying to get no one fired. I could care less. As far as I'm concerned, you guys are in the wrong. But you need to train your, your, your workers to act like the ones in Niles. They don't ha hound me about no fucking cell phone. I go in there to pay. They don't even ask me about it. But your fucking uh, Wick office, every time I go in there, they fucking hound you about that shit. Every motherfucking time. And I'm tired of it. So I'm done with your service. Spectrum, your service is shitty anyway. Your cable service. I mean, pixelation package I have. And uh, I could just imagine. Well, I already know the cell phone service. My boy got it. He said it's garbage. It's terrible. So, I'm going to get YouTube TV. I will use your high-speed internet, obviously. Oh, in fact, it's not even that good, but I'll use it because I don't know where else to turn. Oh, I hope you... I, I want you guys to get that video and put it online and show a textbook why, how not to treat customers. Me paying my cable bill was secondary to this girl. All she cared about was that cell phone. All she cared about was that cell phone. I knew when I went in there and she's like, oh, I got you, I got you. It was like they were fighting over who can get me. I got you. So I went to her because she was new and I dealt with the other ones. I dealt with them too before. And that's why I had to make up a name about fucking lie about some fucking free service. So, and this girl turned out to be worse than the others. And I'm, like I say, I don't want, I don't think she should get fired. I'm not trying to get no one fired. They're just doing what they're told. But the Niles office doesn't do that. That's all I'm saying. Tell your fucking workers, don't even mention the cell phone. If they want to mention it, say, we have a cell phone deal if you want it. And then the customer will say, well, really? But I said four fucking times. I don't want a cell phone. I just want to pay my bill. I go, look, I just want to pay this bill. I don't need nothing else. But that was, you know, fuck her. It was her fucking fault. It wasn't the company's fault. She should have fucking known. You don't fucking hound someone about a fucking cell phone, a service. When they say no, they mean no. What the fuck? Is she a fucking salesman, salesman rapist or something? She's trying to rape me, make me fucking pay for service I don't want. I mean, what the fuck? I said no. God, just thinking about it pisses me off. I drove up the Niles with the intention of paying the bill, but I thought about it. I'm not paying it now because your service sucks. And why should I drive 10 miles out of the way for inferior service? And the fact that your fucking people over there wouldn't fucking, wouldn't fucking take my money because they were too busy trying to sell me inferior cell phone coverage. Fuck you. Fuck you, Spectrum. You fucking garbage. I'm done with them. Plus, I got fucking earners that ain't earning enough right now. I'm getting fucking, I got a whole bunch of earners that ain't pulling their weight. Motherfucker.